down to do a reading for the collective. It is just going to be a general energy check-in, so it may or may not resonate with you. Just take what resonates and leave what does not. Don't make something fit your situation. If it doesn't fit or does not make sense, are you okay? I hope everyone's doing well. I'm just going to shuffle and then I'll pull the energy around the reading and pull the reading, okay? Okay, Spirit, what is the energy around this reading? Um, okay. There is it's like um there could be people around that don't want to see you continue moving forward in the direction that you're going. Um it's like wanting to see you in balanced in a way or, or lose like focus on something you're doing. They may be trying to do something as far as your health or affecting your health or that could just be your well-being in some way. Um, it's like wanting to cause conflict or adversity um, to see you in like regret or in lack. Um, there's like not being able to accept. It's like not being able to have like acceptance. Hold on. <clears throat> not being able to have acceptance around a space that you've come into or um maybe a place you're in in your life or it's like it's like there's regret or blame that there could be like wanting wanting that for themselves or something you have that other people may want or have like envy around or have like conflict around it it's it's like dimming the way people feel in some way, it's something where there's something that you you could have, or there's something that people see. Um, about a direction you're headed in, that people there is this like feeling of um, is this feeling of having regret or wanting to stop some sort of potential because there's worry around the potential that you hold that you're moving forward in so it's like trying to like win at all costs to stop you from coming into this space or this light that you hold that is your destiny or it's your it's your potential outcome it is your outcome and so it's like trying to cause conflict adversity um put you in regret um, make you not feel as empowered as you are in the space that you're in. I feel like this is something that's been going on for a while or something that you've overcome in either way. It's, it could have been going on for a while so you've overcome it because it's like coming from this place of feeling like less or lack or it's like almost like sick feeling to becoming really confident to becoming really aware of the situation and not being affected by it. Um, whatever regret that was trying to hold on to you or keep you tied or bound, it's like having really heavy awareness around that. And whatever adversity was trying to come in and cause conflict, it's like you have this high level of awareness around the regret and the adversity that was happening. So it's like the ties and the bonds around the worry are not causing conflict and adversity at this point in time because you kept pushing forward and moving forward in this space. And even if you were in conflict at one point or the conflict did catch you at one point, you came out of that because um, of the perseverance you had to move forward in um, whatever this may be, however it may resonate for you, okay? So I'm gonna pull. Um, 
Yeah. There's like not wanting to see that these is like people were wanting to hold you back by causing this conflict or intentionally causing conflict to hold you back in a space of being in like um you could be somebody that's been in the younger energy or like making you act immature or making you act in a way that was not aligned with the space that you were needing to be in to succeed or to come into um more confidence uh it's it's keeping you stuck in a less mature energy, um, which you needed to show up maybe as being more stable, or maybe that is how you are. But it's like people are trying to come in between. People are trying to come in between. Maybe this like um, it's it's like you have this side of you that could be like teetering between like regret and strength and. It's like people, third parties, outside outside perspectives kept coming in and causing this um, conflict that was holding you back and was putting you in this space of being in this um, regret energy that where you were offering maybe a more immature side of yourself, but really you show up as being this really divine like energy that is really strong and people are trying to make you seem less mature than you are by causing con like it could be like backhanded conflict or like um manipulation like um but it's like done underhandedly so it's like people don't see straightforward like it happening in your face but it's done like through different ways like uh, manipulating um like mind tactics and stuff like that and so it's like what's happening isn't being seen in like the in like public but it's like happening behind the scenes or like through energy or through like manipulation or through energy stuff that isn't seen out front but then the reaction may happen and you may appear like more immature but you actually are a really strong like divine could be like force in some way um and it's just like all this conflict keeps coming at you. I feel like from multiple people or multiple groups of people. And then they're like, oh, look, that person's so immature. But it's actually like these outside groups that are causing this conflict. And then they're like, like, yeah, it's like they're coming at you aggressively with, it's like they could be attacking you in some way or like sending attacks your way in, in some form with the with the yellow and the orange it's like through energy I feel like you could be somebody that's really intuitive it could make them really happy to see you give like a reaction like if you if you're somebody that has like a like a knee jerk reaction it could make them really happy to see you do that or to act like on like impulse which you could you could do because you have this um this regret with this courage next to it and then the page of pentacles with the queen of cups so you could have like this polarity of going in between like um like conflict between like this these opposite sides that you may deal with maybe daily um which you could be like you could have some mental m mental um Maybe you deal with mental, you know, with the justice system, you could deal with like mental instability and people may use that against you and like use it, like people could take your illness and use it against you, um, which is really sick. It actually, they're probably ill themselves if they're doing that, to be honest, um, I feel like all this comes from, it could be somebody you're in a relationship with, um, it could be some sort of stability you have around a relationship you're in, and you could be married to somebody that has a lot of stability, provides a lot of stability in your life. You could be in a really happy home or have a really happy life with somebody, and people have some sort of conflict around a relationship or a connection that you're either in a marriage around or in like an engagement or um, that you're in a connection with. 
And it's like having this conflict around that situation and not realizing that whatever conflict they're bringing towards you is just making, if they're wanting to get something from the person you're connected to, it's just making that person dislike them even more. Um, it's not making them, yeah, it's making them not interested in anything they have to offer. They don't, they're not interested in any offers coming in from um, these outside people that are coming at you aggressively.